Good morning, everybody, and welcome to episode 82 of Pumpkin Days with Camille in Pumpkin Vale. Looks like we've been blessed with a little bit of rain, and like I have lost poop that I really need to clean up, because I'm not sure how that got inside my house. Alrighty, let's go. Let's shovel it. Okay. You know what? Somewhere in here I have got kidney beans, and I, I really need to find them. Let's check it out in here. There they are, right in front of me. Ooh, I also have a seed thing. Let's grab that. All right, now the poison mushroom, because I'm hopeless at handing them over. Uh, let's grab my seed box. And we'll just throw these in there just for the minute. I know, I'm going to have to start putting things in season. Okay, I do have to start putting things in seasonal boxes. Let's go in that one. Let's call it our... Autumn seed box. Okay. And we'll call this our all seasons seed box. Yeah. So barley, if I remember rightly, is all seasons but winter. I'll know what I mean, hopefully. <laughs> there we want this one. Alright, so autumn, huh? Summer. Spring, all seasons, all seasons. I think, yeah, that's just summer. Saying so, spring, summer, beet seeds, summer, summer, summer. All seasons, summer, all seasons except winter, summer, all right so these are all summer seeds, we may turn this into the summer seed box yet, ban apples, all right, ban apples, all seasons, summer and fall, oh okay no no, tree, oh man I don't even know where I'm going to put my tree, spring, spring up here, summer down here, okay so it's kind of an all seasons log of poison bits, okay give me a minute, let's uh, go to my all seasons, all seasons box and uh, all of these there we go that's bacon that can go in here uh, right let's have a quick look at our seeds what I'm trying to do is find the, the fall crops be sure that's in all seasons yeah ah this looks like fall fall avocados fall hellbore fall Full. Oh, am I full again? Ugh. Yes, I'm full again. Okay, hang on a minute. All seasons, all seasons. Yeah, back up to seeds. Alright, I need to plant those as well. Alright, let's just grab my chicken eggs, pop them away, pop the milk away, pop the cheese away. Because we've now delivered all of that. Oh, that's pretty good. Right, last go at the seeds, ginger dragon. Alright, so we're going to uh, try and find somewhere to put all of these seeds. I guess. Um, and I need to just check. Okay, Uramaki needs avocado. With we're looking for avocados tomorrow, pineapple tomorrow, buffalo chicken. What did I miss out of buffalo chicken? It was something simple, wasn't it? And so avocado for the uramaki and buffalo chicken was celery. Okay. And coconut chicken was coconut. I'm going to need that milk back. 
Suzuki was um, white bass, Italian salad, might have been tomatoes, kapamaki, kapamaki I've got. Oh no, where to go? Look, it's in there somewhere. And I need oranges, which is, uh, oh my god. Alright. Jim needs 10 ginger. Let's just see if we've got 10 ginger, because we may have. We just may not have remembered that we had it. There's eight. Right, there's my 10 ginger. That honey can go away now. That barley can go away as well. The cumin can go away. And the parsley. And the lavender. And the vanilla. Okay. And the soy sauce, and the oil, and the mayo, and the honey, and the flour. I think we've actually got enough flour now. I think the rice, the rice needs to go in the fish fridge. That emerald fridge is gorgeous. I love it. Okay, the saltwater eel can go. And the rice. All right, sort all the things up. There we are. I'm going to put the corn dog in the animal products fridge just because I'd like to be able to find it sometime when I need it. There we go. All right. Let's just go through what we've got. Cymbidium orchids. All right, and hellball seeds. You know what? Let's go. I don't say we were doing this for this round. We we're going to go and get hellball seeds from Diamond Falls. Hi, Pony. Oh, yes. I know. We're going to go up to Diamond Falls. These things are worth, if you're wondering why I'm grabbing them, they're worth 400 apiece. And we were going to try and work out how to make them, so that is uh, that is also on the cards. So yeah. I remember there being a second place for Cymbidium orchids, and we, we will have to hunt for that shortly. First we're going to go to Diamond Falls. Um, basically because I want to buy my 20. Alright, we'll grab our mail on the way through. Thank you. Alright, so I want to go and buy 20 hellbore seeds. Actually, I only want to go and buy 10 because I haven't planted the other 10, so... So when you've played the three towns a little while, you'll be able to work out where the different places are. Woo, nummy. This is the flower nice shop. Nice to see you. Yeah, nice to be here. Okay, how are you doing? With the blessing of the fire god, flowers do grow in some areas of the mountain. Lucky me. Alright, Hellbore. You want to buy another 10. Because that should give us flower seeds for Nicholas. Yeah. Okay. What else did she have for sale? Just because we're curious. Sporeal, Stromeria, Daisy. All of those will grow in Pumpkin Vale as well. Oops, let's have a quick chat to Natsuo. How you doing? I hope everything has been going well for you today. You should take some time to look out from atop some of the hills and cliffs around town. The view is absolutely gorgeous. Oh, pumpkins! Okay, this is what grows in Diamond Falls. Some of these crops will grow where we are, but you know what? Rather than run around like a mad thing, I'm going to buy 10 pumpkins and we're going to have ourselves some pumpkin seeds. Not all seeds will grow in diamond falls from the fruit there, but that's fine. This is one of the prettiest little towns ever. Okay, I'm going to check my chore list before we go too far. 
because I want to be able to return uh, to finish any errands that are up here. I think I had something for Tanya, didn't I? Yep, so something for Tanya. And I can't do the chicken coconut curry for Nora, but did I, did I at least leave the milk on board? No, I completely forgot to. All right, fine. Let's head out. Uh, we're probably not going to catch Poppy, but you know what? Let's give it a try. We'll head straight out to Spoonie Island. We're going to try and get an owl cake for Dee. That's Poppy. And drop things off to Poppy. Thanks. You're welcome. Thanks. And I think that's the last Hello. thing we had for her. Watch anything good lately? It's a bit far, but I'm thinking about asking Gemma if I can have my own show about amphibians. That would be so cool. Oh, it would be lovely to see a frog extension for this game. There's so much in it already, though. How are you doing? My sister Olive and I have always been close. There was a rocky period when we were little and we fought over her Easy Bake Oven. Those were the first cakes I ever made. Yep, I can return that to Alexis. And our cake. Oh, I can only buy one at a time, but that's okay because I needed that one. Alright, I need... Come on, Luca. Let's go find Alexis. She should be in this house at the end. I don't know if she'll be awake, though, so let's go find out. Excellent. It is appreciated. There we go. We have given her the thing. Greetings. Okay, we have nothing else. Must be luxurious, multi chapter, slow burn intensity, preferably with some good. Never mind. <laughs> That's uh, she's a bit of a snob with her fiction. Oh dear. All right, I think we finally managed to finish all the errands out here. Let's head back to Pumpkin Vale. Oh, do we want to head back to Pumpkin Vale? What's my backpack like? Yeah, okay, we're going to head back to Pumpkin Vale. Just travel through. And... All right, so now I know where I'm at. All right, so what we're going to do tomorrow is we're going to look for white bass, celery, and uh, avocado. All right, in the meantime, in the meantime, did I have anything Why, hello. for Jamie? No. Okay, all right, let's see what we've got. No, no. Oh, pineapple was the other thing. No, Tanya, no, Suzuki. Okay, so pretty much there's nothing here we can... Oh, Evan. Uh, where'd he go? I don't think he's here yet. Let's just... Uh, beef chilli for Evan. He may be on his way, though. Or he might be on his way home, I'm not sure which. Let's not run mask down as tempting as that is. It's nearly ten o'clock. And here he is. You're really welcome. Thank you. Okay. So none of these we can Alright. Oh, we can go find D. D might actually be and you know what, while we're out here, we might go and find, see if there's any sage. But what I'll do to find that is I'll start at this end. To be honest, I think the sage is further around. Alright, this is rosemary and basil. Rosemary and basil, rosemary and basil. Okay, yeah, so I think the sage, oh, we have to go past the, oh my. I feel the thing. That's 
but I've beaten them. What are they doing still? Huh. Hey there, Camille. We want to talk to you about something important. Yes, very important. We have a proposal our boss wants us to extend to you. A proposal for you to make a lot of money with Jones Corps. We hear you're a very talented farmer and we want you to grow some special fruit for Junk's Core. Special fruits not found anywhere else. And we'll buy them from you at a premium price. And with premium prices, you'll get rich quickly. I bet you can buy multiple properties in no time around the island. We'll also share our secret Junk's Drink formula with you so you can make your own Junk's Drinks. All you need to do is help us get the factory built. The sooner the better, of course. You can support us by buying a bunch of Jounce drinks at the market. Then we can prove that there is a demand for Jounce in the town. Then the company will speed up the production of the factory. Even if you're the only one buying it. But we don't have to tell anyone that, right? Maybe like a hundred drinks or two to super speed up the factory's construction? Think about our proposal. The offer is open until the first of winter. So help us build a factory before the winter season. Once the factory is built, come and see us again, and we can begin our partnership. Oh, Luca, let's not ever walk this way again. This is horrible. All right, so maybe that's why Jounce hasn't gone away, because um, this has been added, and I need to somehow not help them. Oh, man, that's chilling. I hate those guys. They scare me. They're just very freaky dudes. Okay, this looks like Basil. Don't you worry, Charlotte. We're not going to give anything to these guys. Can you imagine not being able to pick herbs or fish? That would be horrible. Alright, we're going to look for some sage. That looks like rosemary. Yep. I love, this is the other thing I love about this game, that the little plant models and stuff are so accurate. Um, most of the time, there's a, there's a couple that aren't quite true, but most of them are really good. I'm just taking the ones that aren't quite true as a, a variation for this part of the country or the world. But uh, most things are very accurate. Oh, is this my sage? I've forgotten where to get it. Yes. Alright, so this is sage. Is that my midnight alarm? That is. How much sage did I need? Ten. Alright, I've got six. You know what I can do with six? I can actually um, just grab Luca. With six, I can actually plant some. That's not sage. But there, there should be another patch in this area. I just can't exactly remember where it is. That looks like basil. Yep. So this is, this is one of the things. Oh, that looks like sage over there. One of the things I really love is actually being able to, to tell the difference from looking at it. No, this curry. Oops, my bad. It's usually I can tell what, what plants I'm running it up to. It's so much better when your baby has a head. I did one episode where the head disappeared and it kind of worried me a lot. Um, this should be bay leaves. So this is one of the ones where it's not quite accurate, but um, it's fine. Fine, I'll pick it up. Cloves that have fallen from the tree. Uh, I'm looking for more sage. See, this is why we don't go roaming around the jungle late at night. Because we can't see the bugs before we run into them. 
Oh dear, I know, so focused on the herbs, so not focused on the wildlife that might hurt me. Oh no, I know, I'm scared of scorpions now. It's like, ow, great abandoned hornet. Oh dear. Okay. Alright, so that was Sage. You know, I'm having an incredibly hard time finding any more. Oh, um, I'm going to have to do a guide on it, which means I'm going to actually have to find the different patches of Sage. Oh, we've been up there. We don't, we don't want to go past the factory again. Those guys are super scary. So this was, um, that particular scene I think is something that's come through, so that's the sage, okay. That's come through in one of the, the latest updates, is you've now got this option of, um, of playing for, for jounce, and actually playing to deliberately destroy um, your island paradise. And I'm thinking, um, out of curiosity, I might actually play one character, just design a character that would betray the hearts of everyone, um, and actually sell out to Jounce, but not this one. None of the characters I've started. Uh, just to see how that scenario goes, because it is an option. You don't have to, um, you know, look after the world that you're in. The thing is, is I just think it would be so sad to, um, to see and to do that I'm not sure I want to do it. Because, I mean, this place is gorgeous. All right, let's go see if we can find Jelmo. Actually, no, let's go to bed because I've just looked at the time and it's oh my really good. It's how can we how can we still be up this late? So we're going to trot across to the swamp um, bus stop, and we are no, that's curry leaves. We are, and I picked them. That's how I know. Going to go this way. So we might it might be quicker if we if we put a few of these sage things to seed and um, then what's parsley put a few of those things to seed and actually planted them because she only wants how many? Ten. So I only have to plant two seeds of sage, and we've got we've got our ten parsley. Oh no, I forgot. Oh no. Okay, now it's working properly. I don't know what was wrong with it before. Maybe I was hitting it at the wrong angle. Do I have anything for rose? <sighs> if I were working so much, I think I'd go down to the ocean sometime. It has a very different kind of smell compared to the dress shop. Good point. This kid is just like, go on Luca, get some sleep. I'm going to go put the kid in the cot. And then I'm going to go see if I can feed Fayaz. Aha. Uh because -huh. I've got chicken soup for him. What's up? Yep, there's breakfast. You're really welcome. Morning television. Yeah, it's way past 6am. Almond ice cream. Okay. I know. It's Saturday too, so I don't want to sleep too late. I'm going to just sleep for a couple of hours. All right, we need to get celery, avocado, uh, white bass, celery, avocado, white bass, um, pineapple, because there are four recipes we can't make. So, so if I wanted to sell everyone out, I would, um, I would buy what I could off Jounce right there. Actually, let's have a quick look at my cheese and mayo. 
All right, so I, I'm going to need a ton of milk. I've got plenty of eggs. Actually, how much cheese was it? 50. Okay, and mayo, probably 50. We're just we're just going to throw those into the um into the shipping bin straight up cuz that takes a load of worry off my mind. My cheese cucumber Alright, we're short on cucumbers. Avocados, that's what we're after. Let's buy 20 of those. Lentils, I'm going to buy 10. Uh, dragon fruit, I'm going to buy another 10. Because I've got some experimenting to do. Uh, I think we're right for sugar apples, white cheese and all the rest. We're definitely, definitely fine with black beans. So many black beans. And I'm not really looking at my backpack, am I? Okay. Uh, peppercorns, carrots. I've got carrots I can turn into seeds. I'm not seeing celery. Okay. So maybe that's why... Uh, what are we looking for? It's not there. Okay. So we're going to have to head for home. I know, I'm just going to grab the pony. And we're going to have to empty our pack. There we go. It really disturbs me the way the baby bounces on the ground. <laughs> when you come, when you come home. I'm out of my, yeah, okay. All right, while I'm here, this needs to go. Uh, the sorrel seeds need to go because I can't grow them here. The curtains. Uh, yep, that'll do. The white bougainvillea trellis oh, can go here. Pick the baby up again. Again. Alright, and we're going to put the grandfather clock. Yeah, okay, let's pick the baby up again. I'm just going to pop the baby in the crib for a minute. Just simply because I'm tired of throwing her on the ground every time I do something. Uh, we don't have celery, but I also don't have space. So let's very quickly uh, put our goods away. Where's my I can't be bothered sorting things out fridge? Here we are. All right, and the pumpkin needs to go. Salmon fillets, yes, I can experiment. The sage can go. Hellball can go. All right. Okay. This is fish, right? And uh, this is meat, right? Okay. Oh, that is still not enough space. Okay, you know what? We will sort out our... Oh, no, give me that. We'll sort out our errands uh, tomorrow, but I'm going to put all my stuff that might be for errands in this fridge. There we go. I know, that's that's. it's going to take me ages to un-mess un that. I just want some space. Okay, now we're good. So we, we're going to just go, we're going to find uh, celery, avocado. I think I'm going to have to fish for white bass. That's the other reason why I just cleared my backpack, although I cleared it of stuff I probably could have used. It's 11.02. Alrighty, we are going to hit, you know what, let's hit Diamond Falls first because... Diamond Falls has the biggest array of stuff. So. Wow, there's a, a, an invisible wall there for the horse. Building rainbow trout. Sardine lobster flounder scallops. Mackerel shrimp clam grouper. 
celery. This is what I was after. I'm going to buy 20 celery. And I'm going to buy 100 coconuts. And I'm going to buy 100 cocoa. And you know what? I think we were short of oranges. Let's buy 50 of those. Okay. Now that we've settled down a little bit. All right. I'm going to buy 10 spinach. I'm going to buy 10 passion fruit. Like I said, I don't know what I need. Uh, I probably don't need 10 cotton, but I'm going to buy it anyway. Durians. I think I, I just don't get along with them. I think it's because they've got a really high fructose level. Um, and I don't want to... Yeah. Okay. So this is me just building up my cooking supplies mostly. So celery is a Wahoo beach product. We can get peaches in the wild. I might have to do a peach run or a fruit run. We could do a fruit salad run. I do not need coffee beans. Olives, I think you just need for the oil. Um, I've already gone nuts on the, those three. Figs, again, they're, they're one of those things I don't like and I suspect it's because that's, they've got a fructose level that's beyond my tolerance. All right, let's have a quick look in here. I'm gonna buy um, a lot of milk. Chicken we're good for. I might buy I might buy another 50 butter, because I'm not sure how much of what I've got is actually. I'm going to buy 10 of those as well, and we might as well add another 10. I know, I haven't slaughtered my cows yet. Did I buy chicken? No, let's buy chicken. So, um, we, we got a little bit of leeway for experimenting on things. Uh, let's have a look. Is this... Alright, I'm going to buy some more green beans. I'm going to buy some more broccoli and I'm going to buy some peas. I don't think I've bought them before, so we'll buy 30 collard greens I've bought before. Kiwi fruit. I know, I'll be walking home the way I'm going. Sweet potatoes. Actually, let's buy 20 of those because I don't remember buying them before. I think I have, but better safe than sorry. Okay. Let's have a look at my own. All right, so we really need to buy some white bass, not buy some white bass, catch some white bass with a fishing rod like we're meant to. All right, so we'll look at our own produce and see what we're short on. We're actually pretty good for most of these. We don't have kale yet, but that's a winter crop actually. Kale, wheat, cauliflower, lettuce, turnip, blueberries, black beans. I need some tomatoes. I've got kidney beans now. All right. So we've got a goodly amount of that. Let's, um, I know, we're going to go nuts on the dill weed if I can find it. No, see, they, they know my tricks now. Sugar, rice, seasoning, tofu, beef, chocolate, chicken, bag of barley, mustard sauce, salt. Just buy a hundred. I can get plenty in the mines, but I have I've been a bit lazy and not gone down there. Plenty of soy sauce. Let's just buy ten hot sauce. Uh, let's buy ten mint because I, I hit the mint pretty hard this time around. Chamomile, we're good. Camellia, we're good. Okay. I know. All right, so we're pretty good. Oh, what's in the bin? I will have the bacon. <laughs> Tanya, what did we need to get? Tanya milk. All right, so this should wind out um, what we need. I gotcha. You're welcome. Oh yeah? Welcome to Diamond Falls. My name is Tanya, the local secretary. I hope you enjoy your stay. 
Uh, yeah, I'm not staying very long. Oh, another curious owl. Yes. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to just head... Uh, I'll just ruffle that bin. Yeah, no. Looks like the doc, doctor, what's his face? Dr. Hank has been throwing his old discards out again. Let's take a quick run. We haven't got any pineapples yet. So let's take a quick run down to Spoonie. Um, and we'll go to two places in Spoonie Island. The first, oh no, not Spoonie, oh, Wahoo Beach I should have gone to. Oh, ugh, my bad. I may have missed the market. Not yet, I haven't. Let's see if we can get some pineapple. Uh, I need the... <laughs> so the answer to that question is no, no I can't. But it disappears at 7. And I'm pretty sure I just missed the... Um, yeah, I just missed Masika as well. Fine, I'm going to go home. <laughs> um, I'll just have a look and see see what sort of limit I've got on that particular errand. It's... it's uh, Pineapple candies, I've got two days. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a run down to Wahoo Beach next, probably, yeah, tomorrow. And uh, we will see exactly uh, what happens there. But in the meantime, I can now actually, oh dear. <laughs> I know, right? What is that? It's poo. Oh, Charlotte, come back, my poor little baby. It, it is disturbing me quite a lot to, to have her land on her well-wrapped bundle on the floor. So, all right, so she should be okay inside while I run around like a lunatic out here because we do have to collect uh, these. All right, so the good thing about the cinnamon trees is they tend to fruit for all seasons except um, winter, I think. They might fruit winter, I'll have to pay more attention. So maybe if I don't take up Jounce's offer and, and if I've filled the museum, Jounce will go away. All right. Oh, wow, I've neglected my bees. I'm going to have to put things away in order to pick up all the honey. All right, let's just fill the fruit fridge with the fruit. Is that actually full all the way? Yep, so I can just do a quick sort and it'll take out what it already has. All right, wind things up. This is the oh my god, I don't, can't be bothered sorting fridge. Let's just take out a few things that we know that we can fix. All right, is that a zucchini? I'll add some more to that. So things like I should have put these over here and that. Okay, that won't fit. Oh no, it will fit. Okay, good. The honey can go away. And all of these can go. Actually, I needed to grab that sage and turn it into seeds. Alright, I've done something with it. Don't ask me what. So this is all um, meat for the meat fridge. I should, I should really have that in there. The wasabi can come out, that should be in the fish fridge. Do I still have these owl cake? No, clearly not. Okay.
and we still didn't manage to get tomatoes. Oh, that's a pain. Okay, these, this is a veggies fridge, yeah. So let's put the veggies in the veggies fridge. fridge all of that's fish okay fruit and veg fridge all right I'm gonna throw these in as well because I can I forgot the mayo can go over here. Let's just sort this up because I'm pretty sure I've got... Yeah, see that shouldn't be there. Okay. Now I know I bought 50 cheese and I know I bought 50 something else. It's just got a little bit closer. So that shouldn't be there. That should go in the shipping bin. That should go in the shipping bin. All right. Let's actually just have a look at uh, what's on our quota. And we might just fix a few of these. So kidney beans I'm going to have to plant. Cauliflower, soybeans. All right, soybeans I should be able to put in. We have a bunch of them. We need 60. Okay, so 50. Sixty. So that's our soybeans done. Cauliflower. That's our cauliflower done. Cauliflower, soybeans, carrot. That's our carrot done. Barley. Now I had a bunch of barley. I think it might have been seeds though. Let's just have a quick look over here blueberries we needed those so let's just grab those and I'll grab this and we'll halve it as best we can there's the dragon fruit oh that's ginger dragon that's dragon fruit I muddled the two up because they're really similar, but they're not that similar. Okay. Sweet potato. There's more. That's ginger dragon. I did have celery. Okay. All right. Here's my barley. Let's just grab that pile. So how much do I need? Collie, soy, carrot, barley, blueberries, turnip, uh, turnips and rice. I think it's probably turnips and rice is all we've got left to grow. So there's my turnips. Uh, barley, blueberries, turnip, rice. That's oats. 
I think I did process all my rice into edibles though. And there's my mayo and there's my cheese. Alright, so we're going to have everything done by about two or three things. Let's just take that out to our shipping box. So this should do with our quota quite nicely. The next thing I've got to deal with is are my deliveries. So, and I put all of my deliveries in the meat fridge. All right, let's just sort this up. Grab my delivery list. Two days for that. Did I miss one? Oh no, okay. Uramaki. Now, Uramaki was uh, avocado seaweed, wasabi and rice. So fish fridge, seaweed, rice, wasabi uh, and avocados which I think I stuffed in the veggie fridge. There we go. There is another pile somewhere I just can't remember where they are. All right uh, I may have remembered it wrong but let's just see how we go without looking. So this should theoretically be Uramaki. Yes. How many did he want? One. Okay, we're done. Pineapple candies we can't manage. Buffalo chicken was a thing that needed celery, but it's got a bunch of other ingredients that I don't know. So chicken meat, of course, butter, bell pepper, garlic, and celery. And this one I really am reading off the side there. So celery, bell pepper, Okay, uh, garlic, butter and chicken meat. So the garlic should be in here. Garlic and the butter and chicken meat should be in here. There's my owl cake for D. I'll just grab that out while I remember it. Academia, so there's my butter and there's my chicken meat. Okay. Two buffalo, three buffalo chicken. All right, let's go with the buffalo chicken. So, celery, bell pepper, garlic, butter, and chicken meat. Chicken meat, there we go. All righty, and I need a few more of them now. So, basically, we need, let's go into meat dishes. There's our buffalo chicken. Uh, I think I needed to cook two more. Uh, J, so two and three. So I need three altogether. Excellent. Coconut chicken curry. Now, I could look it up. I mean, I could go looking it up on the wiki again. But I think what I'm going to need is I'm going to need chicken and curry powder. There we go. Chicken curry powder, coconut, where did I put that? I think it's in the fruit fridge. If it's not in the fruit fridge, it's in the, oh my goodness, I've run out of space everywhere else fridge. There we are. Uh, and I'm pretty sure the curry has, that needs rice, that's right. I think. So let's just have a quick look at our other curry recipes curry. So coconut beef, coconut curry powder, cooked rice. So coconut curry powder, cooked rice. In this case we're doing chicken. You, you know what? We're going to just grab... Do I have a pumpkin in here somewhere? There's a pumpkin. Uh, and I want, I want a potato as well. I know I don't want much, just the world. Uh, grab that potato. 
All right, because I, I remember having two other dishes. You know what? I'm going to grab some pork and I'm going to grab some beef and I'm going to grab some mutton because I'm really tired of having these alternatives. Oh, and I haven't worked out how to make sausages yet. All right, first things first. I need three coconut chicken curries. That's my priority. So experiment, chicken, curry powder, coconut, rice, cook. Excellent. Now when we go into curry, we should have that recipe. Yep. And we want two more. Okay, there's our coconut chicken curry. Now, the, the, the reason I'm a little bit distracted is because I reckon... Well, let's have a look at our curry. Coconut beef, coconut chicken. I reckon there might be coconut pork and coconut mutton. Let's have a look. You see, potato lamb is mutton. Ah, I do potato chicken as well. So potato curry powder cooked rice and chicken. So potato curry powder, cooked rice, chicken. And someone handed me a, um, a pumpkin chicken curry. All right, so these, this is for my shipping bins, just because I got annoyed at not having the recipe. So coconut chicken, coconut beef. Why don't we try a coconut mutton and a coconut pork? So that'll just be a matter of switching out the first ingredient. Yes, coconut pork. And so we've got coconut beef already, coconut pork. Coconut lamb. This will be the coconut lamb version. Where's my cooked rice? Uh oh. Alright, let's just go into the fish fridge again. Oh no, we're out of cooked rice. No, we're not. Ha ha ha. Alright. So we're doing mutton and then I guess we're just going to add curry powder and coconut and cooked rice. Yes. Okay, so I'm thinking if we wanted to follow this path, see, so I don't know, is that like just maybe straight coconut curry? I don't think so. I think this is highly unlikely. Okay, it might be unlikely, but it was worth a shot, and we got it. So that fills. Yes, look at that. Nicely filled. So pumpkin curry. So if we follow this logic, potato, potato pork, potato chicken, potato beef, potato lamb, we should be able to have pumpkin. So the only one we've got is pumpkin chicken, right? So this should be pumpkin curry powder, rice, pork, pumpkin curry, yep, yeah. and that means it should be pumpkin, curry, I should have bought more pumpkins, <laughs> uh, rice, beef, yes, okay, and this should be pumpkin, curry, rice, mutton. Yes. Okay, I'm doing this because I want to discover all of the recipes. And I could wait forever to get all of the recipes. So if this is mango... Okay, so... Let's go find our mangoes. I know I'm way off track now. There's our mangoes. 
Let's just have a quick look because I think we might have all of the all of, all of the potatoes. We've got all of the potato beefs now. We have all of the pumpkin pumpkins. Let's go for mango. So the only mango we've got is mango beef. So mango, curry powder, cooked rice, chicken. Okay, yep. And then I reckon we've got I've got curry. Uh, that's probably pork. So let's go. Wait, did I run out of pork? No, I cannot have run out of pork. What? 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 Oh no. Okay, let's just fix that. There we are. See, you guys thought I was crazy buying that much meat. I am a bit crazy, but that's okay. So we're going to go pork. Mango, curry, rice. Right, which just leaves us with mutton. So there's our mutton, mango, curry, rice. Yes. All right, which means look at that so i'm going to go through and i'm going to say that that's probably pork and that's probably beef and these are just made with one meat so do we have chicken we do so let's go beef curry rice cook yeah And that's probably pork, so pork, curry, rice, cook. That sounded like someone coming into the house. Yay, he made it in and he left. I'm, I'm so glad to see you. Glad, glad to see you. And he's gone. Fine. Okay. Breadfruit curry, tofu curry. These two I don't know. But I think I think we can call that pretty good haul of recipes. Now, before I got distracted, I was supposed to be Uramaki. We got our Uramaki? Yes. Got our buffalo chicken? Check. Got our coconut chicken curry? Check. Suzuki. Okay, that requires fishing. Italian salad. I'm going to have to look that up again because I can't remember what I don't have. Lettuce, tomato. Okay, I'm... Uh, I'm I don't know. Okay, I'm going to cancel that because I don't have tomatoes. Orange tea for Sister Abigail. We can now make that. We already have the recipe, so it's just a matter of grabbing the, the tea. Orange tea, not orange juice girl. Alright, now I'm going to grab three. I think she wanted three. Okay. Let's just check. J. Anchovies. I'm going to have to go check and see where to find it. 20 sorrel for Claudio means another run out to there. Forest bakery cake for D is there. Bring Iris some sage. I've... Oh, Jelmo. Oh no, where did I put his flowers? Gardenias. Ginger for Jim. Oh. Okay. Nicholas. Syngidium orchids. We haven't done yet. Oh wow, is it... Did I just... I did. I think I just slept through the work through the thing all right so on that note we're going to go and grab so we've we've managed to cook a whole bunch of new curry recipes what i'm going to do now is i'm just going to grab my artichoke dip okay and i think on that note we're going to go to bed because we're going to have some errands to run in the morning we're going to have to go okay later on today we're going to have to go and find the um 
the pineapples or we're going to have to cancel. But on that note, I'm going to leave you. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit like. If you want to see more, please hit subscribe. I'll catch you later.